Hello viewers, this is Heia Rotlinia. Welcome back to my playthrough of Dragon Quest V, Hand of the Heavenly Bride, for the Nintendo DS. Previously, we did a whole lot of leveling, but now I think we're ready to defeat S. Stark in 15 rounds or less. Our golem is at its max level. And so is our cure slime. So, back down to Mount Zugzwang. And we'll go back through Astark's Labyrinth. <laughs> Hello, Bomb Balder and Virtus. So long and farewell. Ooh, a liquid metal slime and metal slimes. Get him, team. Yeah, stick around. Yeah, stay around, liquid metal slime. Got the liquid metal slime. Yes, guys, stay around. Quit missing, please. Got one of them. Got the liquid metal slime and two regular metal slimes. Madison is at level 52 now. Walter reaches level 26. Nice strength gain for him. That'll help me. Congrats, Madison. And congrats to you, Walter. On we go. We encounter the same group. Get them, team. Yeah, stay around, Liquid Metal Slime.
gotcha. And a regular metal slime. Bye bye. After that, Starkers reaches level 21. With no gains. Someone told me that Starkers doesn't get any gains until around level 60. Oh well. Down, down, down. There's our stairway down to the third level. We're not going up to our hunting grounds this time. Instead, we're going farther down to B4. Farewell, enemies! Onward and downward. Death Squad and Mechano Worms. Enjoy some dispelling action to get rid of your bounce status, Mechano Worms. It was actually Golden Dragoon who told me that. Starkers doesn't level up until around level 60. So thank you, Golden Dragoon. Almost there. Just got to get past these guys first. Bye bye, Barbatos.
Bye bye, foes. And we've reached the fifth level. Let's heal up. Restore some MP. Then we'll set up our team. I'll give the war drum to Madison, the hero. I'll let Heirot the Sun have the Sage's Stone. We'll hand out some Elfin Elixirs. Don't really need the Zenithian Sword on him at the moment. Or the Staff of Anti-Magic for Madison. Make sure everyone has some Elfin Elixir to use. Let's set our lineup. I'm going to use my two golems, Mason and Walter, Madison, and Heirot will be in the starting lineup. I'll swap him out for Curtis as I need to use Omni Heal. And... Give some Seeds of Life to Kyrtus. Boost up his HP a bit. And I'll give the last one to Heirot. Next, the Seeds of Strength. I'll give one to Madison. One to Walter. Another to Walter. Another to Madison. Another to Madison. This last one to Heirot. Alright. We should be good to go now. I'm back, Estark. Grrr. Who are you? Who disturbs my sleep? My name is Estark. That is all I can recall. I do not even remember if I am good or evil. Why are you here? Have you come to destroy me? Then I have no choice. I do not wish to be destroyed. Let us fight. Yes, Estark. Let us fight. Hello, Estark. Have my golems muster their strength? Madison can use the war drum. I'm not going to bother with Insulator this time. Full heal, Walter. Yes, look at that. Now I'll use Omni Heal. Madison, of course, would do a little better with a liquid metal sword, or a king metal sword. But I think he'll be fine with the Flail of Destruction. Yes, eat it, Estark. Muster our strength a little bit more. More Omni Heal, please. More c, -c, -c cold breath. Don't think I really need Omni Heal for that. Let's see if Sancho can crit.
Ah, uh, there you go, Sancho. More Omni Heal, please. Blast a disruptive wave. Fortunately, I don't need to heal after that. Yes, nicely done, Madison. Fortunately, Madison has higher agility than the golems. Looks like I can suck up a little more damage. Now for Omni Heal once again. Yes, take that, S Tark. More Omni Heal. Can we get another crit, Sancho? Yes, we can. Thank you, Sancho. Blast you under your disruptive wave. Actually, we'll bring Heyerot in. Let's not risk Sancho missing. Ah, bye-bye, Estark. Grr, how is this possible? You defeated me, and in only 14 turns! Yes! Very well. I will reward you with this trophy in recognition of your achievement. And we get the Catas Trophy! Thank you, Astark. But bear in mind that I will not be beaten again so easily next time. Bye-bye to you, too. I was really scared for a while, but I'm happy now we've won. Me too, Lena. Yay, I did it, I did it. We're stronger than ever now. We did it, kiddo. What's this Catus trophy all about? Did he make it so he could have an excuse to test our strength? <laughs> he was quite a funny character, that one. Well, you should have seen him in four. Nay! A prize from a mystery boss monster. The Catus Trophy. The game's final knick-knack. Time to get out of here. And take it to the knick First, we'll head over to Gotha. A 
Hello, innkeeper. Yes, I'll... I will grace your bed with my... Hum... With my stately, manly frame. Thank you very much. See my monsters? I didn't catch nearly all of them. Just a handful, basically. And we had Bianca and Tuppence. So let's zoom off to the Nicknackatory. I was training to be a craftsman myself, but I threw in the towel a while back. But coming here and seeing how hard some folk work at stuff, I've decided to give it another bash. I never give up on anything. I always stick at it to the end. I hope one day we'll be able to put one of that man's creations on display here. Manana, manana, the senor, he's still so young. There is mucho's time for him. The articles on display here are simply fascinating. I can't stay away. Excellent. He loves our knick-knackatory. That means the way the exhibits are laid out must be good, too. It's because the exhibits are so well made. That's why it never gets boring, no matter how many times you look at them. For the artisans, it's good to see the work of the others. It's a way to sharpen your skills. These exhibits you have collected, friend, they are something special for these people. Can you believe it? This is where he brings me on our honeymoon. Hey, I just had a thought. Isn't Sancho married? I really don't know. When I hear someone talking about the weddings, I wish I could see your wedding, friend. I... I... <laughs> I wonder if I'll get married one day. That's a long way off for you, girlie. These are dangerous times to go traveling. I thought if we came here to see the souvenirs from all over the world, it might feel a, a bit like a grand tour. Do you think the wife's impressed? If the senor is hoping to impress his wife, he must take her to every dark corner of this place. Souvenirs don't tell the whole story, though, do they? I mean, there's more to the world than what's on display here. I hope it's safe again soon for people to travel all over and see all the amazing places there are. It's up to us to save the world and make it peaceful again so that people can go wherever they want. Tee hee hee! A museum in the middle of the forest. This is fun! This museum it nowhere seems to be out of place in the forest. It is like it's just a big tree. It does smell nice and green here. It feels nice to be in the forest, surrounded by living trees all around.
Well, I think we'll mess around with the exhibits in the next episode. Leave off the catastrophe here. This is Hey Rotmania. I would like to thank you for watching. And these are my stats and equipment. So, this is Hey Rotlinia. I would like to thank you for watching, and I will see you again next time.